Hi everybody, so welcome back to Daisy. Now this video is not only a little bit of a showcase for Bishop's Immersive Storage Premium and Original Mods, but really a plea to the Daisy devs to consider adding this mod to Console Daisy. And the reason why they should con consider doing it and why they should do it is that it's a very clever mod because it only uses the existing in-game assets, which means that Bohemian Interactive doesn't need to buy and license um, anything else that they don't already own. So let, let me, before we go any further, let, let me just explain what this mod does. So if you come inside this little house here, you'll see that we have these extra items. That fridge shouldn't be there, should it? That bar table shouldn't be there. That chair shouldn't be there. What's this? A map of Livonia, but these are all additional, original things, aren't they? Oh, th this bunker shouldn't be there. What are those? What's that barbed wire? And in this shed, oh look, there's some shelves, a locker, and there's some more shelves. And if we go up to these items, you'll see they've all got storage as well. So not only can you use um, the kit that this mods provide to as furniture to make your bases and your you know wherever you are sort of more homely or more immersive and stuff like that they've got the functioning use as well and the way it works is that you can spawn into the world um, kits and then when you pick up these kits you can then place them somewhere um, so let's go into third person so you can see so this chair we can put down and we can spin it around I'll tell you, let's put it over let's put it by this table shall we uh, we could do it sort of like that and then we can place it and that chair is now in place by my little table it probably so it's got one one slot so it can't really take anything it's more of a it, it's more uh, cosmetic isn't it um, to do and then if you've got a screwdriver in your hand he says trying to find a screwdriver you can dismantle these things and turn them back into kits um, and so it is absolutely fantastic because it is the original things that are in the game. Everything kind of looks in place, doesn't look out of place. In fact, it looks more immersive and looks more in place than when you build bases, you know, with the, with the wooden walls and the wooden wooden watchtowers. It is absolutely, absolutely fantastic. Let me sh let me show you another example. Uh, actually, let's put that away. So this is a locker kit. So let's pick this up and let's put this inside my little shed here so we can click put it in place and then you can spin it around uh, let's see if we can get it to go somewhere sometimes things can be a little bit all right let's put it there there we go we've got a locker that we can then put stuff into or there we go. we've got we've got lots of things next to each other haven't we um so yeah so it's absolutely amazing, and as I say, because it doesn't use additional models, it's very, very lightweight on PC, um, because it's just referring to the existing files that are already in the game, um, which means that it wouldn't be very heavy on console. Um, and as I say, the, the biggest thing is the fact that it, because it uses the original assets that were already included in the game, there's no worry for Bohemia Interactive and the devs that, oh gosh, where did this person get this model for this particular mod? You know, did they buy it? Is it licensed properly? Who are we going to have to pay? Could we get sued? All this sort of stuff. Because all this stuff belongs to Bohemia Interactive straight away. Um, and I think it would be absolutely fantastic. Now, on PC, you do have to use this with um, quite a lot of time with a build anywhere mod, or and this is where you can it would work on um, on console. You can adjust your CFG gameplay so that you basically have build anywhere, you know, so you turn off clipping um, and things like that. Otherwise, it can be tricky to play some things some of the time. Um, but there are literally, if we look for kit, Ooh, let's do this properly. Uh, with the with the premium set, you know, there's there's well over a hundred things, and then with the original set, there's about twenty, um, and they would be an, um, such an amazing addition to the game. And maybe you would have them spawn in industrial areas. Um, I would imagine as well we could have a uh, an addition to the CFG gameplay.json file. 
that would say how you um, dismantled them, whether you could dismantle them, whether they put together. Um, I mean, thinking about it, I think the only thing you can use to dismantle the stuff is screwdrivers. So on PC, for example, you can use a um, like an area flags mod, so that within certain areas, if you're if you don't belong to that area, um, you can't dismantle stuff. But maybe on console we would do it by um, restricting access to screwdrivers, you know, you know that that sort of stuff. Um, and it is absolutely fantastic. So there we go. This is my plea to the Daisy devs, um, Bohemian Interactive. Please, please, please consider adding um, Bishop's Immersive Storage or your own version of it to console because it is so immersive. There's nothing extra to license or buy in terms of models because everything is already being accessed from the game. Um, and it's very lightweight, so it's not going to make the game any bigger or much bigger for, for console, because I know that can be a thought. Um, and it should all have the proper LODs and stuff, because, again, it is in-game assets. Now, what I need you to do is, if you're a member of the console community or the PC community and want this as well, I want you to go over to the Daisy Feedback Tracker. And I want you to go over there, and I want you to create an account... And I want you to create new uh, Daisy Xbox bug reports. Now, don't worry the fact that it says it's a bug report. You can request a feature as well. And just write a quick thing, you know, nice and politely saying, please consider adding your version of Bishop's Immersive Storage and Bishop's Immersive Storage Premium to console. I'll put a link to both the mods and the feedback track in the description below this video. Um, and, um, and so, yeah, please can we have this because... I think, um, I don't know, this could be, you know, one of the most important mods for console anyway, if it got added, and I just can't see why they wouldn't want to, because it is uh, it is very, very lightweight, nothing extra to pay, no worrying about um, models being licensed inappropriately, um, and uh, it's, uh, it's so immersive, and so fits in with DayZ. Anyway, what do you think? Go over to that feedback tracker. Make some comments in the description below this video. And if you enjoyed the video, hit like. If you want to see more of the same, press subscribe. And I will, of course, see you again soon.